Hey everyone, welcome back to another Becca Moment. Today, the message that is on my heart is forgiveness. Forgiveness is one of those most important areas that we we know is an issue for us, um, but that we really don't stop and really, really look at and reflect on. But you know, if we want to have more joy and laughter and freedom and breakthroughs in our life, then we need to look at how, we, how we're doing. Do we forgive easily? Are there people in our life that we haven't forgiven? Usually there are. If you stop and think about it, that person will come to your mind really rather quickly. And we, and we might want to forgive, but it's really hard to do that when we think about, you know, the, the pain and the, the hurt and the sorrow that, that we're dealing with because of what, what these people did to us. But, you know, we can't really move forward. We cannot progress to the next level in our life if we don't address forgiveness. So... How do we do that? How do we forgive? How do we learn to forgive? Well, like anything else, I take it straight to the top. If you want to get anything done, take it straight to the top. And I ask my father above and I say, I need your help. I know I'm supposed to forgive. I know you say the person that gets hurt the most is me. And you say the forgiveness I give to others is the forgiveness that I'll enjoy. You say it's hold, holding me back and poisoning me. So I want to do it. I do. But I can't seem to make that happen on my own. So first of all, we go to him and we say, hey, we need help. And then we start praying for those who have harmed us. We start praying that they'll be blessed with happiness and peace and joy and prosperity. Yep, that's what we do. We do that over and over again, day after day, as if we were praying for something that we wanted so desperately for ourselves. And I know I have to say to my Father in heaven, okay, I know I need to do this. I want to do this, and I'm doing the actions, but they don't feel sincere. When I pray for this person, I feel... Um, sick about it. I feel like a liar. I feel a tensing in my, in my heart and in my body and, and even sick to my stomach. But help me. Bless thou my unbelief. Help me forgive them. You know, and it might take a couple weeks. It might take months. It might take a year. And sometimes we might even experience the forgiveness only to be triggered in again and then we have to start the process over but let me tell you I know firsthand from experience that when we forgive we free ourselves well one of my favorite quotes says to forgive is to set a prisoner free only to find out that prisoner was me to forgive is to set a prisoner free only to find out that prisoner was me so what do you think? Do you think it's worth it? Do you think it's worth it to be free, to break through to the next level, to go and start living the life that God fully wanted you to live? Because you've got to free up that energy. You've got to free up that heart space. You've got to fill yourself with light and love so that you can move forward and share that with others. So that's my thought for today. May we all learn to forgive. Cook on that. Until we meet here again tomorrow for another Becca moment.